What's up guys, it's Jay, I'm back with another one. Today, it's another Friday. You know what that means, that it's gonna be another sampler. Today, I'm bringing you guys a local one, a local, local one. Bristol Brewing Company, right here in the heart of Colorado Springs. Bella agrees, that's my, that's my dog Bella. She agrees right from the freaking heart of it. Hey! <laughs> All right, <laughs> whatever. Bella, stop. No, for real, stop, Bella. Back to it. So we got my favorite from the Bristol Brewing Company, the Beehive. We got the Laughing Lab. That's probably its own most um, recognizable logo, I guess. It's that Laughing Lab. We got this Mass Transit, friggin' hippie van. And then this was the... Um, the seasonal that was in the box, it's not really the season, but um, Winter Warlock Oatmeal Stout. Handcrafted Oatmeal Stout. How do I get lucky with these dark beers? Hopefully it should be good though. The logo looks good, so the beer better be good. Got this fucking 50 cal bullet got down opener. Let's get straight to it. I'm gonna start with my favorite. I'm gonna work my way down to my least favorite. Or, maybe I'll go backwards. No, I'm gonna start with my least favorite. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna work with my least favorite, work my way up to the best, cause I ain't gonna fucking, I ain't doing it. So let's see how this shit is. Mm. Smells fucking dark. Mmm, and here comes my cat Fendi, trying to be nosy. Go ahead, Fendi. Oh, shit. Nope. <laughs> I do not like that. Fuck, dude. Ugh. It tastes like... It tastes like I'm drinking coffee beer. It doesn't taste good. It's like, what am I going to do? Wake up or get fucked up? Like, no. It tastes like coffee beer. I honestly don't even want to finish the rest of it. This, putting this bitch off the motherfucking screen. I don't even want you to see that one no more. This is ridiculous. Honestly, you know what? I'm not even finishing it. I'm sorry, guys, but that was... I would finish it, but out of all the dark beers, I think I drank... I think I have drank in... Or drank... Or three dark beers. This would probably would have been my third one. And, like... Guys, no, I wouldn't even recommend that to, that's a prank. You want to prank somebody, you get a beer, dude, this shit's fire, and then they, no. <sighs> On to the next. Straight to the mass transit. This is an ale. Let's go for it. Please, let it be better than the last. That's why I just wanted to get that one out of the way. I knew it probably was going to be my least favorite. But I didn't know it was going to be that bad. The cartoon looked pretty fucking cool on it. They put that much work in the cartoon, but not the fucking beer. Damn mess. This one should be better. I should like this one. Yes. See? This, way better. I would drink this. That... I don't know. Everybody has their taste though, right? Because, I mean, I'm just not a Guinness guy. Some people like Guinness. Fucking serve it right off the tap. Give me a fucking pint of some Guinness. Me? No. I'm good on that dark shit. This one? Good beer. I don't place that one yet. It's obviously placed well because it's still on the fucking... Still in the picture. The next one, <clears throat> we can go to that laughing lab. Scottish ale. Give that one a fucking try. Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. This one, a little bit darker. A little bit darker than the last. 
Excuse me again. Uh, these almost taste the same, honestly. They taste almost the same. I just feel like this one's a little bit more sweet, a little bit. I don't know how to explain that one. Still a good beer though. I would keep it like that. If I had a first, second, or a second, third, I would keep it like that. Cause last but not fucking least, I'll fucking tell you, is how I found them out. The beer that I tried that fucking got it, got me going with them. The Honey Wheat Beehive. Got a fucking 50s restaurant diner lady on the fucking front. Very good beer. If you've ever been to their um, brewery, I've been there. It's it's an, an old school. So, like, just imagine a fucking an old looking school, but they gutted it out and put a fucking brewery and a restaurant and, like, little, little like, cafe and shit. It's really fucking cool. Dope as fuck. You get the drinks fresh as fuck from right there because obviously they're making it. The food, food was good, right? Yeah, we had no problems with it. Food was great. But uh, let's get to it, this honey wheat. And honestly, I've always been a wheat beer kind of guy. I've always liked the Hefeweizens and the fucking, I don't know, the Blue Moons and shit like that. I've always liked the honey, or excuse me, I've always liked the wheat, but uh, Oh yeah, this takes top fucking first place, dude, easily. That wheat, I don't even know if that's what I've been tasting. I've probably been tasting like three different beers in this fucking glass, but it's like, I don't know. I just always like the wheat beers. I guess that's what like I drank the most in Germany too. Cause I guess Hefeweizen is a wheat beer. So it's like, yeah, that's what I just got accustomed to the best. I mean, and you can tell it too with the wheat beers is always gonna be more cloudy I mean, both of these were less cloudy than this. It might be a lighter beer, but it's more cloudy. <laughs> One second, please. I'm just going to remove my dog from the... I just noticed that she was crunching on her fucking... Um, Bella, I'm sorry. Sorry about that, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. Back to it. But yeah. I'm always just like... But I, don't get me wrong, though. Like, I love the Pilsner and shit, but I don't like... I don't like American beers. I like, you take me to fucking Germany, have a bison Pilsner, straight from there, we go to Czech, right, we go to Czech Republic, go get some fucking Pilsner, straight out of Czech, dude, when you're drinking there, though, that's a totally different story, but let me stop getting sidetracked, bro, this honey wheat beer, the best one out of all of them, by far, I don't know, it's just something about that. They say that the, they say that the wheat beers are very fattening, though. Oh fuck, fattening. I'm trying to get drunk. You think I give a fuck if I get fat? Dumb man. I'm trying to enjoy a drink, stressed out, worry about calories. <laughs> but yeah. All right, all right, guys. That's how I rate them, though. <laughs> First, second, third. Do do do. Right down the fucking line. And you know what time it is. Hey, look, we'll bring this one in the frame for a second. But you know what fucking place it got. I'll keep it here just so y'all can fucking remember how much I hate this beer. And I don't recommend any of you to get it. Get a nice little close-up of this fucking warlock motherfucker. Yeah, fuck it. But, oof, yes, I definitely recommend Bristol fucking Brewing Company to anybody. It's just a great place. If you want to try it, if you're in Colorado, go get you some. Try some. But you know what part of the fucking video this is. You know what part, we're well, almost both them, but you know we're getting to the end. Yeah. Oh God, my cats. <coughs> Excuse me. Got a fucking zoo going around. Next thing you know, you're gonna fucking hear a fucking fat ass fucking car car. Nah, man. <laughs> like a fucking elephant. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Let's get done with the first one right off the bat. <sighs> God, I love the fucking beehive. Let's get straight to it, shall we? Ah, cheers to you all. Nice and close. Ah, to you. 
YouTube fans down there. Alright. Do you be I be I wouldn't even chug this shit if you gave me uh no, nah, if you give me money for it, I'll do it. <laughs> I was gonna say five dollars, but I was like, you know what, five dollars and all I gotta do is drink some Let me not fucking talk rational. Rational. Irrational, excuse me. I don't even know how to talk. I'm not that smart. Oh, oh, This next one is that mass transit ale. Whew. Hope you guys are staying safe out there. Washing your fucking hands. I'm not ending it. I'm just saying that just to get it out of the way. Just to say something. Because uh, I gotta fucking let this fucking shit sit down there for a second before I fucking smash like four in a row and I'm like alright guys see you tomorrow no. <laughs> mass transit cheers Not least, it is the least, but it's not the last. <laughs> the laughing lab. Let's pull this bad boy up, shall we? This fucking. How did I drink that second one? Damn, what the fuck? I'm getting like a full beer out here every time I pour them. Fuck, how much did I really drink out of the glass before? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> now I feel better. Laughing Lab. Good old Scottish ale. Oh, it smells like the good old fucking Blarney Stone. Down, man. <laughs> I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure that's Ireland. Down, man. <laughs> Fuck. Sorry I fucked that up, but hey. This is to you, Scotland. Down, man. <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> I apologize. Oh, it's getting hot here. We roll my sleeves up. <laughs> fuck. Alright. No, for real this time, guys. Fuck. Honestly, don't even. I'm gonna finish it. Finish it. The only reason I don't want to finish it is because, like, I'm starting to actually taste. It's, I mean, I'm still tasting each beer, so it's like, I don't know. The, the maltiness of this one is like getting to me. Just fucking tastes like. Ugh. Didn't taste bad when I was fucking trying them, but. Yeah, I honestly don't. Eh, fuck. I honestly don't think I'm gonna go for the rest of that. I saw that one right there. Whew. Whew. All right, guys. That was another beer sampler. Once again, Bristol Brewing Company recommended. Try it out. If not, don't try it out. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Excuse me again. 
beehive. If you don't want to get the sampler, definitely go ahead and try the beehive one. That's definitely my favorite. From there, I fuck with Bristol Brewing Company. And I forgot that they were independent. It's just like, they're very popular here in the Springs and in Colorado because they're from here. But, yeah guys, that's another Friday and another fucking beer sampler down. I hope you guys are staying safe, washing your hands, just staying fucking sane and safe, you and your family. As always, I'm Jay, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay safe.